Um, we put so the men when you're in on the IUD, you don't get periods? No, no. Like my lady does where not. Where does it go? It comes out of her ass. I read about a guy who has like some weird <laughs> birth defect where he comes out of his ass. Those are called gays. Uh, yes. Did you guys uh, draw with your friends? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No. Sleep with What? Oh, never. Yeah. That's a bonding you justify experience. What you're doing. It was never even brought up in conversation. So every year, me and, me and my friends would go out to Notre Dame. My dad would take us to the Notre Dame spring game. Okay. But my dad, he drinks a little bit, so he would occasionally he'd get drunk and invite a guy from like the Knights of Columbus to be like, you want to come to Notre Dame with me and my sure. friends? But for real, we would rent a van and me and like 10 of my friends. We get in a hotel room. We're whacking off. Sure. But before we whack off, one of the guys my dad invited, he's this like old dude, Uh oh. blacked out at the bar, and they had to take him home. Oh, oh, God. So they take him home, throw him on the bed in one of the rooms we have, and then they go back to the bar. Then me and my friends are like, let's, let's f*** with this guy a little bit. So we're slapping him, screaming in his face, shit yeah. like that. He's not waking up. <laughs> He's oh, not boy. waking up. Oh, Dude, boy. we set an alarm clock next to his head and set it for a minute later and turn the lights off. <laughs> and everybody hid. It's one of my happiest memories. That's great. I Went thought you were going to say you jerked off But on. then. Oh, okay. Yeah. But then, no, we didn't jerk off on him. Okay. But we jerked off. Everybody whacked off while he was asleep. Dude, Whoa. This guy, this guy was passed out laying in bed. What did you say everybody? How many kids? Eight dudes. Oh. <laughs> eight, eight seventh graders. Oh. This guy missed out. Off. This guy's. Uh, what, this like, guy's all around him like a all seance? Like a seance. <laughs> <laughs> it was. It was. <laughs> Dude, he was asleep. Oh. A dude was next to him in the bed, and his body was shaking. Oh, <laughs> From the oh, no. I am never going to financially recover from this. <laughs> was it hard to get off with that old guy there? <laughs> I did. It was I guess seventh, seventh grade. Seventh grade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's so keyed up. <laughs> The room, by the way, the room stinks. <laughs> jizz, uh, That's just bo and jizz from seventh graders. Uh, <laughs> all right, so as soon as we got, got done coming, everyone was like, "All right, let's keep fucking with this old guy." <laughs> like, dude, my what? buddy shoved his hand in his head. <laughs> what? Look, pillow. It was just a crease. It wasn't in the hole. Uh, it was sure. a crease. I get that. He gave him a fucking credit <laughs> card jump. swipe, but that's what woke him up, dude. He was like, "Oh." <laughs> is wrong with you? Dude. I was awake the whole time. I saw everything. <laughs> yeah, if he woke up, like... Oh, my God. <laughs> but he he <laughs> kicked us out and yeah. then locked the door. He was blacked out. He was shit-faced. We go down to the front desk and ask the dude, like, can you let us back in? Our uncle locked us out. And he was like, all right. Oh, nice. There's nine boys. Yeah. There's seven boys. Like, can you let us back in? So he's like, all right. So he lets us in, opens the door, the smell. <laughs> <laughs> and then he opens the door and there's an old man with his pants down asleep. <laughs> and he's like, Can you let us back uh, in? All right, for yeah, more? go ahead. Uh, you let us back in. Yeah, wow. Oh my God. That's, what a night. Did see? you guys have the same story? Like, you ever talk in the future? Like, hey, if this comes up, uh, maybe we. Uh, yeah, maybe we don't maybe say we it on the world's agree. largest platform. <laughs> <We're>, uh, <laughs> I used to have a joke about right. Brock Lesnar. I like said, man. I'm not afraid that Brock Lesnar would fuck me. I'm afraid he would use me as a condom to fuck someone way bigger. <laughs> Uh, that's true. He's Terrifying. so big. That's sword he's a on the chest. Beast of a man. That should be. That should be a tattoo. You walk up to someone and like, that's fucking. You look like a dumbass. Dude. Yeah, that <laughs> was one of the worst tattoos Brock of all. Time. No. <laughs> and everyone's like, <laughs> so cool. So cool. nobody want to say shit. Yeah. 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 So, bro, let me tell you Kill something. Them all. That Jeff. guy was such a freak. That Jan guy won Hux. the U.S. heavyweight, cha the UFC heavyweight championship. Look I think that. it was his fourth fight. It's like an action figure. It's it's Jimmy Johns. <laughs> that's an, that's oh, like yeah, that some, guy hits Jimmy Johns all the time. Uh, how many girls finger blasted themselves to that? Guilty. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if women do jerk off. If I was to a girl the, and I was alone I, and I was at home and these two fucking animals would beat the out of each other, fuck yeah. <laughs> Where are women jerking off girl? to? What else would like, yeah, you be waiting for? Come get this pussy <laughs> after you're done. <laughs> Who's the conqueror? <laughs> Who's gonna take me? Yeah. Is that how you would do it? Yeah, if I was a girl. That's my. My personality in a girl's body. <laughs> if I was a girl, that's uh, what I would be. How do you whack be... off as a guy? Just regular. Uh, I'm going to conquer you. No, I hold it in for a few Crazy days. Man. I try not to jerk off uh, more than twice a week. What? Uh, what? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. What? Because then, uh, then I appreciate it. I don't think Whoa. that's that. That's not twice that. a week? That's not that great. I'm a two a day -er. Yeah. What? Yeah, especially on the, the road. Before the show. On the yeah. road, it's hard. On, on the, the road, road, it's, it's hard. Great. It's a great stress reliever before a show. Oh, 
duck face. Oh, mm. Look at him. Look at him duck facing. Was no. it all from Vanilla Ice? Did we forget? No. I don't know. Hmm. Was oh, Vanilla Ice pouty. the first kissy? He's fucking pouty. He's pouty. It's oh. funny, too, that he was just trying to be like, this is what black guys look like. That's what I was thinking. You gotta get the lips up. <laughs> there was like did you ever Sebastian see that? Was um, there was a book that they did. It was a photographic book with uh, Madonna. Yeah, yeah. you see her lately. She's a wild lady. You see yeah. her lately? <laughs> she looks not, fucking uh, nuts. Pull her up. <laughs> it's not her best. <laughs> she looks nuts. Still got a body. And she's doing as good as a sixty-five-year-old woman has ever done. She's aging so gracefully. Good How old her. is she now? She's got to be eighty-one. Actually, her sixty-five. Regular sixty-five-year-olds are beating her now. <laughs> Have you seen her lately? No, she's, I'm sure she's nice. out there. She seems I'm not to saying be, she's uh, not nice. She seems to be doing things. Uh oh. She looks like she filmed. No. She put out a no, video. No, no, she looked no, like no. wet. She made a deal uh, with the like, devil. Like doing soaking things, wet, like doing things to enhance her appearance. <laughs> Shit. She looks hot as f That's Madonna on the left. That's what she looks like. Shut up. <laughs> I'm mean, not listening. But she's truly better looking than me. <laughs> <laughs> still, still. Uh, she actually looks uh, great. She looks hot uh, as f dude. She looks great. She, she looks, looks hot as f this, this, this is ridiculous. For the record, take it back. I think it's weird I think photos it's she takes. takes a big she takes man. a lot of weird photos. Super heavy makeup. You know, she's doing the Jamie, sexy you thing. Jamie, 64. You fucked me, Jamie. So she's doing... She's doing the sexy thing while she's older, and some people have a problem with that. But my that's as hot as you can get at yeah, 64. My dad's like 65. He should start. Uh, imagine. Yeah. Just like imagine Madonna. if your dad brought her home. You'd be like, Fuck yeah, nice dad. Nice pull. Good point. Nice, yeah. dad. We'd have a group whack If that was yeah. your dad's new girlfriend, you know how f***ing pumped you would be? God, if it I wasn't hate my Madonna. mom's so f***ing ugly, great, dude. Really? What a great stepmom for her. <laughs> Pull her up. <laughs> Let's see her. <laughs> dad, how come you don't Madonna right now. I think you want an ugly mom, though. My mom's no prize either, they're, they're and that's better good. better cooks. No, my mom's not ugly. That's not what I've seen. But <laughs> <laughs> I like movie. Adam Driver. Did you see? I love Adam yeah, Driver. Yeah, he's awesome. That he's great. Yeah. He's Loves comedy. Good. Does he? Loves comedy. Came to a few Adam shows. Driver? Yeah. That makes sense. F***ing killer actor. Marine. Was, I was watching this one scene from some movie he played in about a dysfunctional relationship with him and the wife just screaming and yelling at each other. Marriage story. Oh, my God. Incredible. Jesus Christ. Incredible. I'm powerful. You're all the bad things about all of these people, but mostly your mother. When we would lie in bed together, sometimes I would look at you and see her and just feel so gross. It's, it depressed me so much just watching the clip that I yeah. didn't want to watch the movie. I don't I'm think like, I, I want to watch this it. in my oh, life. It's heavy. But his acting is insane. Insane. Every day I wake up and I hope you're dead. Dead like if I can guarantee Henry would be okay. I'd hope you get an illness and they get hit by a car and die. Oh, I don't want to see this. I've walked oh, into this, rooms I like that. We've all been there. It's, it's, too good <laughs> yeah. it's, it's too good. It's too uh, accurate. It's too accurate. We've all had that it's, fight. It's, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not looking for that. No. Yeah. Don't show me what's next door. Oh. I don't want to see what I've already lived through. Exactly. I don't want to see that. Ugh. Show me a movie about a guy coming out of his ass. <laughs> would that Man. be amazing? What would Trump yeah. get drink? Trump on your show? Trump doesn't drink, dude. At all. Damn. You'd have chicken for him. We get some get McDonald's get and amphetamines for the boy. <laughs> Imagine if that's, that's the first time he drinks is on your show. Oh. Bro. Heard about it. I'll try it. <laughs> Imagine his Twitter Mr. drunk. Mr. Trump. Uh, you his know. drunk Twitter. Oh, and his Twitter before was insane, but his, his drunk Twitter would be bananas. <laughs> Can like, you fucking emotional. imagine? Drunk Trump. Oh man, that's a character. Yep. I saw the wait. I, I you saw, saw the him? king, dude. I went to Mar-a-Lago. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> I was in Mar-a-Lago. What? It was me and like ten people. It was just a regular day at Mar-a-Lago. Like a field trip. <laughs> The only people there are 70-year-old billionaires. Yeah, it's not margarita. And bro. they're all wearing MAGA hats, dude. Sure. But not just regular red MAGA hats. Can we hats, get like a flat membership? Brim. Can we get a membership? $200,000 a year. Dude, there's a gold-plated constitution. I don't know. A gold-plated constitution? I think it was the constitution. 
<laughs> Dude, wow. that's the main room. It's so wow. grand. Oh, Jesus God. Christ. Jesus. It's small, though. It's small. It's smaller than you think. Shut up. No, I mean Whatever. that. Whatever. Look this how beautiful This is like the main room. Wow. You know who's doing stand-up now is Don Jr. Really? Uh, he's doing stand-up. Look, still no. checking out yeah, plastic cups. he was just at Palm Beach. What you talk? Jamie, wow. Kodak. It's the mansion. Look at that. Kodak Jesus. Black at Mar-a-Lago. Look at this place. Shout out Kodak Black. My name Kodak Black, but when you see me, I'm white. Like, those people now need better tactics than laying down in front of traffic. Like, they pick the easy route. What those people are doing is instantaneously plugging into virtue. You could no. be the biggest fucking loser ever, but if you're willing to put on that vest and lay down on the highway, everybody will call you brave. Right. And that's if you're is. one of those fucking people that says, we're out here trying to fight climate change, and that's how you're doing it, you're, like, blocking traffic yeah. and making people We're causing idle. a traffic jam, which is actually probably bad for yeah, everyone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Idling yeah. Idling it's certainly bad. Terrible. <laughs> terrible. Also, cars are going to break down, so right. you need more gas burnt to get a fucking tow truck out there. And people get violent. Imagine. Your, son, through. your son's playing football, you, yeah. and your wife yeah. calls you. He, he broke his leg. You're like, oh, shit. If you miss and one you, more, you're trying you're to get out. to the fucking hospital, and some... Dip shit. Yeah. It's just laying in the middle of the road. <laughs> I mean, yeah. And you just uh, want to uh, dismember uh, him. Uh, you just want to grab uh, him and throw him like uh, a sack of potatoes. Yeah. And you got to sit and watch this moron with his shitty idea imposing it on everybody. Remember that lady who laid on the street naked in Portland? During yeah. the height of everything. Yeah, yeah she stuck her cooter out stuck for climate change. Yeah. the cops. <laughs> Wait, wasn't that during, like, COVID? Was like BLM. BLM? I think it was BLM. Yeah, yeah BLM. The white BLM. lady showed her p- to white cops yeah. during BLM. Wait. There's a big finish. No way. Ta-da. Yeah. Good time. They're, like, Sweet. They're, like, they're racist. racist. They're just sitting there like, They're what racist, the so they fuck? need to look at this pussy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Did you ever see that uh, police guy in Louisiana doing the fucking, he's like, to the goblins? What Dude. are the goblins? The, it was a gang in his oh. parish, and he oh, just Jesus. gives a full-on like speech where he's like, come meet us with guns. We're going to fucking kill you. All right. <laughs> wow. Dude. Wow. Good and times. to the goblins, I had this message for you. <laughs> it's so good, dude. Oh, this shit rules, dude. This will just fire you up. The Gremlin Street Gang is responsible for hundreds of violent crimes. Murders, armed robberies, witness intimidation, burglaries, drug trafficking, extortion, and brutal beatings. And if you raise your weapon to a man like me, we'll return fire with superior fire. You think men like these are afraid of an uneducated, 125-pound punk like you that's never won a fair fight in your life and holds your gun sideways? Look at you. Men like us, son, we do dumbbell presses with weights bigger than you and they don't respect you or any punk like you. They'll toss you around like a rag doll. <laughs> Whoa, I got chills. <laughs> How if that nice guy is that? runs for How president, nice is we that? are wow. fucked. Where was wow. that from? Yeah, that guy's if gonna that win. that guy Damn. runs for president, wow. we are wow. f- Holy shit. You've seen the reaction videos of you and shit. Those are yeah. so great. The other- You don't see other sports where the commentator <laughs> is also <laughs> a I've fan. Seen a monster. Like, watch this. Watch this when it turns. Well, watch when we look at each other like, bro, the fuck? We lock <laughs> eyes to eyes. Watch this moment. Watch this. Ah. What the fuck did we just see? <laughs> <laughs> nice job, J Mo. <laughs> Dave Chappelle is about as fucking cool as it gets. He's, he's got so it, cool. as he's they so say. God. He's so Damn fucking it. cool. He's as cool as it gets. He's just a, hearing he's him talent. talk. You're like, wow, I'm here for this. Even yeah. the guy that tackled him and tried to stab him was sad afterwards. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he was like, he was like, hey man, it was kind of it was also, cool. When I tackled also, him. the that guy was, who attacked really him got his ass beat by Jamie Foxx and Busta Rhymes. Busta Rhymes. <laughs> <laughs> Jewish ass, bitch ass. What, John Stewart? What? He I'm saying Mel Gibson should have fucking finished you guys off. Yo, chill, chill, chill. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. He's geezed up now. What's that mean? 
He's, what is he's, he's geese up? Man. What is geese up? <laughs> he pulls geese. his pants up. How is he geesed up and Trump That's isn't? <laughs> what he's does that mean? Old? I put amphetamines. Him, put he him seems in the same, old. Yeah, put him in the ring. We'll see. He oh, Trump will old. kill him. No doubt. But, the homosexual is right. Here's here's one of the weakest moments I had in my life. I was I was against Tiger Woods. For Why? Why? I was a young man when he was getting canceled. I was like, "Fuck this guy." What for cheating? Yeah. I am deeply sorry for my irresponsible and selfish behavior I engaged in. I was young. I didn't know I was being a fucking dumb. I don't care. But anyway, what I was whatever. a young man, and then I watched South Park, and they did an episode about sex addiction, and they were like, "Who's against this?" Why? Why are rich, successful men suddenly going out and trying to have sex with lots of women? Why would a man who's famous and makes tons of money use that to try and have sex with lots of different women? And these rich celebrities have perfectly good wives at home. Why would they even think of sex with others? Damn it! I want answers! <laughs> like, as soon as I watched it, I was like, Damn, I'm, They're right. I'm gay as f uh, <laughs> like, you when I went to start. Australia, I had to fly Air Canada. Ugh. <laughs> doesn't Dude, make any sense. They made me wear a mask the whole time. It doesn't. Doesn't. <laughs> Joe, oh, what's man. it like being jacked, dude? It's better than not being jacked. Oh! Does it feel weird? That's why I do it. No, it's a lot of work, though. Yeah, but it's, it's a lot of work. It. But it comes with mental health benefits. <laughs> That's true. I bet. That's true. It's not. It's not a matter of like someone's better than you. Like that's the yeah, problem. Yeah. With, it's like we people think about like Republicans versus Democrats, right versus left, pro-abortion uh, versus anti-abortion. <laughs> it's all the same <laughs> shit. We're all just fucking people, man. Us. We don't have to do it. This Having is kids is great. Having because you like people, right? I, I, we're all people. We came from babies. Everybody. Like that, you love came from a child. What about the early years when they're annoying and crying and shitting on your <laughs> face? What about the early years of stand up when you first started learning how to bomb? Mm. What, what about fucking everything you've ever done in life where you try to figure out what the you're doing? That's part of what life is trying to figure out what you're doing. There's no better representation of that than a child. You're getting them from the very beginning. Yeah, that's why I had this conversation with you on the way over here. Yep. I think you'd be a great dad. I really uh, do. Are you'd be such a good dad. You'd be a great dad. But everybody comes from people. You don't recognize what a person is until you have a child, and you realize that everybody used to be a baby. It's a real weird revelation that happens. And a lot of my friends that have had kids, they've had the same revelation. But isn't it's it like, scary that every, yeah, every it's scary, everybody's but scary. up? We all have our own problems. Yeah, but we, Mark but Norman, you, my whole fucking life is scary. Everything I've ever done is scary. You just you gotta, gotta go fun? for it. You gotta, you gotta be scared. Everything I've ever done that's important has been scary. That's a Everything. good point. All of it. No, Ari, every time you've ever done stand-up, if you've yeah. meant something is important to you, it's scary. But aren't you worried that you're, you have two daughters? Yeah. Yeah, three. they're gonna go... I'm worried about everybody. They're gonna I'm be worried about scared too. Place, go, this is a bad idea. But if you had children, I'd be worried about your children, too. Of I, course. I worry about people I don't know. That left f***ing poor lady with the f***ing uh, vertical yeah. neck. Yeah. She, at one point in time, that was a baby. I bet that was a baby with unlimited potential. Yeah. And she got the wrong set of circumstances, the wrong genetics, the wrong life choices, the wrong people around her, the wrong influences, foster care, who knows? Does anybody have a life Your hair? bones will crumble. Come not on. even close, dude. He has, he's close. had three drinks. We're five hours not in here. Close. I've had 20. He's had two. Give me that breathalyzer again. Nothing. That's it. All Good. right, what do you got, old man? Because we six. had more than Point one. Oh six, I can drive. No uh, way! What do you mean, no, no way? way. No it's way. Got three Bud Lights. You got, America trusts you. No, plus four, three of those, plus three of these. We, we America trusts you. I can drive right now in most states. Yeah, you, you look good. <laughs> Are you scared of having you kids? You can definitely drive. Stop, yeah, stop losing confidence in yourself. How do you feel? I lose confidence in the system. You feel wasted? The system? Yeah. Or this little machine that we the bought machine. off Amazon? The machine. <laughs> 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 That's a bullshit machine. No way. Joe's had oh. five drinks. I've had 30. That, you're cute. You oh! Won't.
cute. You, you don't understand what's happening here. <laughs> you don't understand how cute I am. Hey, he's a cute kid. <laughs> uh, I don't know about you guys. I'm pretty fucked up. I Joe, you it. won't talk that. You won't. Oh, Peer pussy. pressure. Uh, I'm going to hold on to it for a little bit. Just dude, talk to you guys. Right. Yeah, yeah right. coward. You won't do it right here. Come pussy. on. This you come guzzling Nazi. Put it down. <laughs> yeah, fear factor sucked. Here we go. News radio. Yeah. All right. I wonder Everybody if anybody lives. on Flight 93 was on an edible. Somebody must have been on edible on uh, that flight. One guy at least. Oh, one yeah, guy like, just right. going to the building like, whoa, this is pretty cool. They shot that f***ing plane out of the sky. Yeah, the DC almost no yeah, doubt. Yeah. yeah, almost no doubt <laughs> almost they shot no it out of the sky. The Wait, wreckage was scattered for miles. In Somerset. They yeah. should have. Huh? Yeah, they're they supposed to. You they just didn't want to say it. It was not a hijacked plane. It was headed towards... I'm saying that we let's roll all that. Probably didn't happen. That was to give America a victory. Like, we fought back against them. We got our, you know. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, what, they crashed the it into the about? ground yeah. to save the White House. Yeah. The f out of they, here. They, 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 they grounded all planes. One plane suddenly wasn't talking and it was headed off its course yeah. towards the White House. And they were like, Hello, they are you there? They found the wreckage. <laughs> Get it. The what? wreckage was spread out over miles. And if the if yeah. like those people are dead Bush anyway. She was out doing coke and they were like, Cheney's like, I got it, dude. Just <laughs> go read the kids. Let's say there's 200 people on a plane. And those 200 people are 100% hijacked, there's terrorists on the plane, and they're going to crash into the White House. Now, instead of 200 people dead, you have 2,000 people yeah. dead. You don't uh -huh. think they're going to blow that thing out of the sky? Had to. They I have haven't to. heard of it. This they, is the first time I'm hearing of this. It's oh, the yeah. protocol. Yeah. Yeah, it's not even... even... back then, it was like, this seems fishy. I but... talked to military guys about it, and they were like, yeah. They think that the United States invasion of Iraq was... Not only was it like one of the worst decisions ever in terms of like human life... Yeah. They think that like a million people died that yeah. wouldn't have died. Yeah. Yikes. And what is it? It still sucks. Yeah. If you go there right now, is it better? No, my driver no. was from Iraq. I was like, how is it? I goes, it's bad. And I'm like, is that just certain regions? He goes, <laughs> no, it's pretty much everywhere. It's just really bad. It's bad. It's really? bad. Dude, there are parts of the world that I really wish people would either know about or visit. Yemen? Before they, yeah, before, before they even <laughs> yeah, think, man. think about like what you think the world <laughs> oh, is. Oh, man. If you think about what you think the world is, you think the world is fucking Santa Monica. That's yeah. not the goddamn world. The yeah. world's not Brooklyn. The world is weird. The yeah. world is weird and it's like bubbling all around us. We're like the center of cheese that hasn't been fucking cooked by the heat yeah. yet. Mm. All the outside edges are all crispy and fucked up and it's starting to get to the center. That's us. That's America. Well, why can't they chill out? Well, they need resources. That was the yeah. whole thing. Was just people are going to cut it, try to kill us, and we got to kill them first. Be ready to fight them off. Yeah. That They're was coming. every every form of life. Yeah. When, I, when I say us, I mean that's still I don't mean now. us. You think? Yeah, but uh, we don't need a fort with cannons. We just have a missile defense system. Yeah, it's the yeah. exact same thing. Yeah, <laughs> it's always been. There.